Hello there. Welcome to Sean Academy. Today in this video we're going to learn how to start a bird breeding business. My name is Sarah and I will be your instructor in this video. Before we start a bird breeding business, let's take a closer look at what goes into starting one and how we can make yours profitable. Exotic birds are raised for resale in a commercial aviary. A bird breeder, also known as an avian breeder, can operate a small backyard aviary with only one breeding pair or a multi-million dollar purpose-built aviary, with dozens of employees. A commercial aviary can sell to individual customers at retail prices or run a breeding program to sell wholesale to established pet stores. The costs of establishing a commercial aviary business vary according to the size and type of operation you intend to establish. The cost of establishing a small-scale backyard commercial aviary breeding a single pair of parakeets is much lower than the cost of establishing a large aviary breeding exotic birds, but the possibility of turning a profit with a larger facility is much more realistic. You will need at least one healthy breeding pair, two or three good-sized cages, a nesting box, a brooder, hand-feeding tools, food, and other supplies. This is in addition to the most expensive aspect of bird raising, the avian vet. 1. A license. The requirements for raising birds for profit vary by state. Most states in the United States restrict the types and numbers of birds that can be raised without a license. Licenses typically cost around $100 and are valid for several years before needing to be renewed. 2. A breeding pair. A good breeding pair can range in price from hundreds to tens of thousands of dollars. It all depends on the species, the breeder's quality, and the breeder's ages. 3. A nesting box. Nesting boxes can be found for less than $100 online. 4. A cage. Depending on the size, cages can cost anywhere from $100 to thousands of dollars. If your cage will be outside, you will need to include the cost of a heater and a shade covering. 5. A food. Food should not cost more than $1 per bird per day. Purchase quality food designed specifically for breeders of the same species. Bowls, water dispensers, hand feeding tools, and treats are also included in the food budget, but at a low cost. 6. A brooder. A complete store-bought brooder box can cost over $500, but if you have basic carpentry skills, you can make your own brooder for under $100. 7. A avian vet. This is the most expensive ongoing cost of bird keeping. A quality avian vet will charge hundreds of dollars for a routine checkup, and serious injuries or illnesses can cost thousands of dollars in vet bills. The most expensive ongoing expenses are vet bills, food, and electricity. Individuals looking to buy a bird as a pet or large pet shops looking to buy birds in bulk are the best customers, depending on the size of the commercial aviary. While retail customers will pay more for each bird, retail selling necessitates significantly more marketing to find customers. Selling birds to individuals and pet stores is how a commercial aviary makes money. The price of a bird depends on the species, whether it was hand-reared, the local market, and how much your customer is willing to pay. According to the U.S. Department of Labor, a bird breeder can earn between $18,000 and $57,000 per year. Commercial aviaries can increase their profits by selling food and supplies to people who already own birds. There is additional compensation for people who are willing to care for customers' birds while they are away. If you found this video useful, please show your appreciation by clicking the like button. Also, let us know in the comments if you'd like us to make a long, comprehensive follow-up video to learn more about how to start a bird breeding business. Also, don't forget to click the subscribe button to see more videos from Sean Academy. An extension for education.